how to use wordpress with equid hi guys welcome back to another video and in this video i'm going to be telling you how you can use wordpress with your equid store so having said that let's just jump into the video so over here i'm on the dashboard of my wordpress website and it's pretty simple right now i'm just simply going to go ahead and go over to my equid account right here over here on equid and i'm just simply going to go ahead and log in right if you don't have an account you can even get started for free as it is free and it's pretty simple and you can just simply sign up with google or apple or facebook wait for a couple of seconds and you are good to go then it's going to go ahead and open up over here where you just simply have to set up in just four questions right nothing too major pretty simple so i'm just simply going to go ahead and name this uh right here and i'm just simply going to go ahead and click on next fill out this form and answer these questions like pretty simple question nothing too serious uh they're basically going to ask you what are your trying to do you know have you ever had any experience before what type of product are you selling and do you already have a store for someone else and are you creating a store for someone else just simply click on next and do you already have a website no and then you can go ahead and add in your store over here and then just simply click on finish and proceed enter in your store name and you are good to go right Next, what you're going to do is you're going to go back to your dashboard on your WordPress and you're going to go into the plugin section over here. Once you're in the plugin section, just simply click on add new plugin and over here, just simply search for Equid. So if I search for Equid right here, you're going to see this plugin right here called Equid e-commerce shopping cart. Just simply click on install now and wait for it to be installed and then just simply activate the plugin. There you go. It's installed now. Now we just simply activate the plugin right here and once it's activated you are good to go then you will have your equid store over here so over here you just simply you know add your online store to your website right of all you create a new equid store or connect your store as well so simply click on connect your store and then it's going to tell you what you have to do everything is pretty simple right so over here this website is asking this uh, you know website for permission and then just accept it and then we are good to go and boom here we go so over here this is going to be how it's going to look like so you're, it's going to load up the control panel for your equid store and over here you will have all the options that you would have on your main website over here you will have them over here such as dashboard your sales your catalog your marketing reports you know your overview your sales channels mobiles you know your design storefront payment system and all of that so that's how you pretty much do it right that's input all of your account over here now what you can do is you can go ahead and click over to the design section over here click on storefront over here and you can just simply go ahead and view your storefront so over here this is the storefront right here so if i click over here you know this is going to be my website right here as you can see my equid website and i can go ahead and edit this out as well so over here we can go ahead and click on the store appearance and you know edit our website as well edit our store so over here it's going to load up the control panel again and over here you can go ahead and design your store so over here you have your image signs i'm going to keep it to the medium the landscape i'm going to get it keep it as a square then we have the product details and all of that and everything else so pretty much everything we're going to need is over here we're good to go right next what we can do is we can also design the website as well so if you click over here on the design section on the left side you can go ahead and start designing your website as well so let me go back to my dashboard and click on my website and storefront and over here i can go ahead and view the store page as well but uh and you can even you know access your setting from the equid control panel itself so if i wanted to let's say set up my storefront over here and I could edit my website over here on Equid. The website that I have on WordPress is gonna, you know, change as well. So let me show you real quick. So it's gonna open up the editor in a second over here. So over here, as you can see, this is how it looks like, right? Pretty simple, nothing to show you. It's a simple drag and drop type of, you know, website. Over here is gonna be your store name. You have your main options right here, and then you have your product over here as well so let me just go ahead and click over here onto the header section and we can start designing our you know header over here so if i click on design i can change the design of our header so this is how it's going to look like right pretty simple uh i want this one over here and then we have our site logo as well we can upload our site logo we can change the background and we can add the menu icons over here 
So I think this design looks pretty good. And I'm going to go back over here and then we're going to click on cover. Then we can change the cover image. We can add in our the title of our website. We can call it Equitessor and then we can go ahead and move on. We can add a tagline for website as well. We can add some different design elements over here. We can change the layout. We can change the background color. We can change the title as well, the description. And we can even add the images and primary action and secondary action. Everything over here is going to be, you know, added to us. So if I click over here onto the cover, we can change the cover image as well. We have, we can even change the site logo for our header. I forgot to change that too. So I'm just simply going to go with test store. TS stands for test store. And then we are good to go, right? Pretty simple. And then we have the about us section and we can change that as well. And then we have the main option right here called feature products. And over here, we can manage all of our products by clicking on the manage products option over here. And we can add and move different products over here. And if I were to, let's say, you know, uh, delete these products, I can go ahead and delete them. And I can add new products by clicking on the add button over here. Or another thing that is you can go into my apps over here, go into the app store and, you know, and then over here, you can go into drop shipping applications right here. And you can use this drop shipping application called Sub Drop Shipping, which is a free application. And just simply install it onto your Equid store. And once it's installed, we can, you know, use it to import different products from AliExpress or other websites as well. So if I click over here, you know, I open it up into another tab right here. You can go ahead and sign in and log in and create an account with Sub. And it's simply going to go ahead and open it up. So over here, this is how it looks like, right? So this is basically AliExpress drop shipping. We're going to go into the dashboard right here to the sub. And this is how it looks like, right? Over here, you're going to have your total sales, your total earnings, your money saved wallets and all of that. So what we're going to do is we're going to click on find product over here on the left side. We're going to click on imported products. And over here, we're going to add the link from AliExpress into over here. So if I open up AliExpress in another you know, tab right here, and over here let's find ourselves a product that we want to import so we want to import apparels you know men's fashion or women's fashion so over here if i click on men's fashion right here we're going to have a bunch of different options right here and we can go ahead and start importing these products into our store so for example if i wanted to let's say let me find another image right here that looks pretty cool let's go with jeans maybe even jackets and coats actually and over here, we're going to have all of our jeans and jackets in store, right? So let's say that I wanted to import this product right here. Then I would have to do is just copy the link right here. Go back into the dropshipping product over here, the dropshipping application, and paste the link of the product over here and click on import product. Then it's going to import the product over here. And then we can import it into our store. And then we can, you know, sell that product on our store. Wait for a couple of seconds. I couldn't import that product, but I imported this one. So as you can see, it works. Simply put the link over here, click on products, import product, and you will have it. So then what you can do is just simply click on list it to the store. And then over here, the store that you have, and then you can input your amount. So as you can see, it's going over for $35. So we need to at least add, let's say $15 for the shipping. So that would be 50 and we can sell it for, let's say $60 and we'll click on enter. And over here, all, all, yeah, we can go ahead and choose out our description and product and images and all of that. And then we just simply click on list now, wait for a couple of seconds, and it's going to be imported into our website and we are good to go. And there you go. So that's it pretty much. That's how you link your Equid store to your WordPress account. And that's how you add different products into your Equid store so that you can sell it from your WordPress store. So that is it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, let me know in the comment sections down below and I'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible. So having said that, I will catch you guys in the next video. And until then, take care and goodbye.